it's Katarina Rodriguez, your Miss World Philippines 2018 and today I'm gonna show you how to do a summer glow makeup look. First, I always hydrate my lips, my face, you can use any uh, chapstick, any lip hydration. Next, um, you can moisturize your face. Usually I prefer something with an SPF but I don't have that with me. I always carry though a primer. Um, some primer is also moisturized. You'd want to get that. So you just put it all over. And then move my hair out of the way. And then after that, I conceal. So I like to use a cream concealer. So I just take the cream concealer and I put it underneath my eyes. Then my T-zone, anywhere that's red. And then you just kind of blend it all in. For underneath your eye, you want to blend it in like an upside down triangle. So you want to make it go down, if that makes sense. I'm not going to use foundation because in the summer it's really hot and you don't want your face to look like you're melting. And I just put it all over, kind of just dab a bit. You don't really need that much. And then I go over it um, with that same brush that I used to blend the concealer. I get a bit and I go underneath my eyes again. This is so it doesn't, sometimes like underneath your eyes, you'll see the makeup gets all cakey. So this is to smoothen it out no matter what happens. This is one of my favorites, the translucent powder. The translucent powder I use is the, this one is the Laura Mercier. And then I take the setting powder. I'm using the Studio Max Fix. This is NC40, so it's also a bit darker than what I normally am. Because whenever I, there, whenever I tan or I go out in the sun, my skin gets darker. And then with this, this one is also one of like my essential products I always have um, because this will cover up anything that's not the same color as the rest of your face. So you want to go over the concealer with, and the translucent powder with the loose powder. So from here, after that, I like to do my brows. Currently, I'm using the Sunny's Face um, Brow Kit. I really like it. From here, neither of my, okay, both of my brows are different. This one, I like to say is my sexy eyebrow. And this one's the cute one because it's always up. <laughs> so I just try to make them as even as possible, as symmetrical as possible. That's really the goal when you're doing makeup, to create symmetry in your face. Of course, it's kind of impossible, but Challenge accepted. <laughs> and the eyebrows are always the hardest part. So when I do my eyebrows, I always line it to the end of my um, eyes on both ends. That's the farthest you want to go. And I kind of just do little, I'd say like, I create like feathery brush strokes. Um, with the pencil and then I just brush the brows up kind of blending the pencil and if you have another mirror and you're using like your bathroom mirror you can check with the other mirror there's this my mom taught me this so you kind of just does this make sense like you check with this mirror through the other mirror to see if you made it to the end and you want to try to follow your the natural shape of your eyebrow as much as possible. Then I use the Sunny's Life Brow Grooming Gel, also in warm brown. Oh, there, this way. This is so nice. And I use this for the inner part of my brows to create that bushier brow look. After that, I do the eyeshadow. So for summer, I like to use uh, more neutral colors. This one is soft brown, it's back. Um, and the more layers you put of this, the darker it gets and the color changes. And then I just go over my eyelid 
with the color. And by that I mean from the crease of my eye going down towards my lash line. And I like to use, again, because of my um, the undertones of my skin, I like to use like purple shades or like maroon shades for the contouring of my, my eyes. So using the same brush, I take the tip of this brush and I get the color and dab and then starting from the outside going in on the brow bone that's where I put the color contour for the lid you can kind of see well you can see it right away just working from outward in and then I just blend it from the brow bone down to the lash line on the outer edge there then the other side then I get another this brush for something like this is a lighter um, highlighter eyeshadow color it's all that all that glitters also from Mac and I use this to kind of shadow the inner corner of my eyes and it creates like this it's like a highlighter sometimes I use my finger depends how much you want to put I feel like you can control the finger more so I just use this to brush the lashes in place and up and so next I get this brush which is usually meant for foundation it's like a bigger version of this one but I don't use it for foundation I use it for blush and right now I'm using, it's from MAC, it's also blush. From the apples of my cheeks, I just brush it this way. So it's almost like I'm using the blush to contour. And I put a bit on my nose to give like that sun kissed look and then there's a trick I learned um, where you know you put enough blush if you're standing about like a foot away from the mirror and then you can see the color and you look flushed um, this brush it's like a flat brush you can use a bronzer I'm gonna use a darker like contour and color starting from your ear you just blend it inward and then again draw this con to contour everything it's nice to use a bronzer for summer you always go from out in that's one of the secrets for makeup like you did with the eyes it's the same thing for the face and then for to contour more, there's this part of your forehead where you just line with the bronzer or the contour color. Again, just bringing the color down. And then with that same color, you could take this brush. This is to contour the nose. And you just get a bit of that color. And for me, I like to contour starting down this part of your nose, well, my nose, and then then I just contour up towards the brow, and then I blend it. Okay, then I take this brush, and then I take, I'm using like a highlighter. Um, you can use bronzer, lighter shade of bronzer, highlighter, and then I just blend everything on the cheeks together and again excess i just go around okay and then last i like to use um lip tint and i'm just gonna use my fingers for this and you just put it in the center of your lips then you can take your ring finger and just spread the color can either just do this to 
create like very natural lip color. Always from the center out to make your lips look plumper. And then you can take a gloss and take like a pink gloss or like a more nude pink color. And again, just in the center of the lips. And then you let your hair down. And there you go. And that was my summer glow look. If you guys have any comments, questions, or any other suggestions, just place it in the comment section below. Thank you. For more celebrity beauty, follow starstyle.ph and the other social media links below.